Hello everybody, I had some nice folks reach out to me about checking out their rotating keyboard tray and when I saw this I thought this would be a good thing to use for my classroom. I'm a teacher here and I'm kind of tall and I have this table here but when I stand at my table instead of sitting I have to kind of spread my legs out a little bit here to in order to see my screen better. So I thought with this rotating keyboard tray here that this would be useful for me in my class. So I'm gonna try to put it together here. We're gonna take a look at it, see how it works for me. So these are the things that showed up in the box that I got. This is the base where the keyboard tray goes right here. Also, two of these little things here were included. These go on the top and the bottom. I've already pinched one in the top like that. This is a little foam thing to keep the keyboard from sliding out. And so it's got some little holes right here, holes right here. Let's pop this other one here real quick. You can see these are spread out a little bit different. So make sure you turn it the right way. When you do this, there's a little drawer. Make sure the little drawer where you can put things is on the left hand side when you're doing this. There we go. Already kind of snap in. There we go. A little snapping sound. There we go. All right, very good. Okay, so now you can see the wrist rest is at the bottom right here. And this is where the keyboard will hold, it, it'll hold the keyboard in. Also, and then at the top, there's this little stopper at the top. So, and we see we have a little drawer right here. This is gonna go on your left-hand side. Pull the little drawer out right there. And now we've got to get this big bracket on these holes right here. Now they do include some tools course to do this with so we're going to flip it upside down and we're going to work with these tools here and getting this on all right all right so the next thing we want to do is we want to get this big huge metal uh, bracket here and we want to get this on the bottom of the keyboard here I'm going to go ahead and hand tighten these in here hand screw these in for these six holes there's only six screws included in the package that they sent, and these screws all go straight in these little holes here. So we got the keyboard tray put together on the bottom here. Next order of business is to get it attached to the table, so I up that. that's not going to be any higher, so I'm trying to get higher here, let me turn it like that, right here, I think would be the best for me. All right, so these hinges are also adjustable underneath here. I think for me, just getting the keyboard up higher and being able to work right here, I think this is gonna work. For me, that's the whole point of me using this. So I'm using the big Allen wrench. They have two Allen wrenches. I'm using the bigger one. All right, to tighten this. So this is something else here, I'll tell you what going to be a big change for me hopefully for the better I'm thinking so all right so now here we go let's get the keyboard now I can adjust we can adjust the angle of this if we want there is a uh, an allen wrench that's included and you can adjust those and tighten them as needed and kind of push it down some too a little higher all right, okay, so I got the uh, rotating keyboard installed. I tightened it with the bigger Allen wrench like this. I have it uh, on top up higher to raise the keyboard for me. And um, I, my thought is, you know, to not have to bend my legs and come down like this so I can stand here straight up. Right under here is a secret little drawer. Look at that. So you can put uh, you know, jump drives or, you know, sticky note. 
can put jump drives or sticky notes in there, maybe a pencil or something like that. You can close that right up. So the clear look keyboard tray can be uh, put a number of ways. We talked about under the desk. Now, you know, I've, I've turned it around here to get a different look just to kind of feel for it. This is a day or two later, just kind of get a different look for it. Here's L shaped here. So it's way up high in the air and uh, we can rotate it around, turn it away where it's not bunched up so close to the monitor like it was there. So that's a different look for you there. Play around with it, see what works for you. It's very sturdy. I know that if you're needing something like this, instead of you know purchasing a you know a, an entirely new uh, stand-up desk, this keyboard tray, rotating keyboard tray, it takes the place of that. So you don't have to go make an extra purchase, a much more expensive purchase, or perhaps a desk. And now with this keyboard tray, rotating keyboard tray from Clear Look, you can do you know set it up however you want. So check it out; it may be work. It might work for you.